baby. How you doing, Virgo? This is for you. I've been noticing a pattern with our uh, order operations, how we do things. It seems to be the most pressing matter always come first. And for you, my baby, wow. I, the title for you for the next few days is going to be hookup. You learned about what a hookup is, my baby. That's what you learned. I heard you went from the worst, like what was you thinking, you know what I'm saying? And then also I want to tell you, as in, you weren't the worst, you know what I'm saying? The other person or other person you interacted with was the worst. But for you, it's still like what was you thinking, right? But I was told to tell you that you are a star, an overnight celebrity, my baby. You know what I'm saying? You out here getting them on the low, you know what I'm saying? While you been in hermit mode, I see what you been doing. You been making a name for yourself. You passed the test, and, and you broke in. How about that? Also, the, the theme for you going to be is incest. A lot of people keep alluding this topic, but you know how we go through it, to and through. You know what I'm saying? I've been having messages that you have a first cousin that's been desiring incestuous relationships with you and have been going to the extremes, right? So I also see that sets, you know, what sets you off on your journey, my baby. What set you off was you notice a pattern. You just started noticing patterns in your life, right? Not only just with your family, because you know your family isn't just who related to you by blood, right? You know, there's also, the, you know, the ones that, you know, have mutual love with one another. And they're most high, the, the most high, the highest self, right? So two patterns you definitely learned. The first pattern that you were stuck in, right, was just meeting up the fuck. Meeting up the fuck motherfuckers. You know, you have been doing that for a lot a while. You, you had a person you were sleeping with for a long time. You know what I'm saying? And you started to peep that they weren't your family. They were under the guise of your family, but they were st steadily fucking you over. You see, my baby, because you was green. You know what I'm saying? You were a little naive and you didn't know any better. You didn't know to stay out of the way of toxic motherfuckers. Motherfuckers that just want to suck on you. Either way, literally or figuratively, trying to suck on you. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people that you were fucking, you know what I'm saying? You were the best they ever had. You know what I'm saying? And... Of course, you would letting them suck your energy or whatever. Motherfuckers be popping up out of nowhere. As soon as you thought you got rid of one vampire, here comes another one to suck you of your juices, your creative spark, your money, you know what I'm saying? Just your sex, all aspects of your life. And you learned that they weren't family. That's what you have been learning. But I see you learn what making love is, my baby. That's evident. You know what I'm saying? Out of nowhere, you took that step. You know what I'm saying? You stop hooking people up. You stop being around toxic beings and toxic things. You know what I'm saying? And you definitely started to go outside more. You started to make love outside. Spending time with nature, tapping into yourself. And out of nowhere, bam, look at you now, my baby. Content as hell. You know what I'm saying? The star, the celebrity. You know what I'm saying? And shit, now you sitting back and you like your life now. You like what it look like. You know what I'm saying? And you you enjoying your life right now. You know what I'm saying? And you realize that this toxic um, person in general, toxic beings and things, you know what I'm saying? They like to watch your life. You know what I'm saying? Instead of actually getting out here and putting the footwork in, you know what I'm saying? They like to sit on the sidelines watching you. You know what I'm saying? And you also have another person that's in the background. Because, you know, we're going to address this. Because, you know, it's been an energy for a little too long and to and through, like I said. So you have a person 
one of the first persons that you were intimate with, okay? Coming out the woodwork, trying to entice you. You know what I'm saying? And you, you're going to know this person because, you know, the, the sex was really good. You know what I'm saying? And it appears as if they dropped us on <laughs> my baby. You know what I'm saying? I see you thought it paid out. You thought it paid well. You thought it paid well. You thought you was getting over when you was messing with this person. But now you see looking back, you know what I'm saying, that it was a distraction to keep you from focusing on yourself. You know what I'm saying? So you pay attention to people you call family, my baby. I see you learning now. Old friends, <laughs> old family members, close friends, or close family members. You know, watch all these motherfuckers. Because you definitely have at least two people doing candle work in your energy, you know. And I see you definitely been getting messages. I see you definitely been tapping in, getting these messages out here. You know what I'm saying? You're finding out that your highest self knows you better than you really thought you knew yourself. You know what I'm saying? You you, you notice the other, the, the, the man from your past or the woman from your past was coming to you in your dreams. Also, it's shape shifters. You know what I'm saying? They were telling lies. But I see right now, you got to see that at the round table. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. See that at the round table, my baby. You know what I'm saying? And I see some people want to mess with you that you never even slept with before. But you know now who's using you and who's not. You know who's undercover. And you ain't with that dumb shit. You see, because you, you a new lover of life, baby. You are reincarnated. You are the fool. And I know you've been seeing a lot of rainbows. And you, you getting your pot at the end of that rainbow, too, my baby. You know what I'm saying? And you see who money ain't long for all the shit that they be asking for you. Isn't that kind of sway? People ask you for things that they're not prepared to even offer you. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, you can you can sell who wants to cover my baby. A lot of these motherfuckers is just hating because you happy and you moved on. You know what I'm saying? But you know, anytime you run across a motherfucker like that undercover, it's a test. You can tell all the people that just want to fuck you and people that want to love on you or to make love to you. You know what I'm saying? But right now, see, so you ain't giving a fuck about none of this shit. You know what I'm saying? You know about fair exchange. I see you consent. You just got to making love on the beach, outside, you know what I'm saying? In the middle of nowhere. I definitely see that. And I see now you're staying out the way. And now you don't let nobody suck on How about that? Fair exchange. You know what I'm saying? But I know you're tapping in. I know you're tapping in. I enjoy what you do to and for me. It feels good to know you care for me like that. I wish to experience it more and more each day. That's the real desire. Not no childish hunger. You know what I'm saying? People be trying to fulfill their hunger for love by sexual contact. And that does that never comes Never, ever, ever. I can't stress it enough. All this hypersexuality, instead of forgiving a person, forgiving themselves and their parents for the lack of empathy, intimacy and physical warmth from a childhood, and because they don't, that exudes into all aspects of their life. You know what I'm saying? But I see that you know how to make it this, you know, separate the two. You know the difference between adult sex and and child is hungry. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Definitely, yes. I see somebody making love on the, making love on the beach, laying back and unwinding. You know what I'm saying? Being faithful and loyal. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, somebody from your from your past has definitely been texting you, my baby. Y'all see, you getting a lot, a lot of revelations. I was told to pay attention closely. Events are unfolding for you. And you getting revelations about a close um, relative or your childhood. But just know people out here trying to make you sabotage yourself. But I see you awakening to that. You realize that, my baby. You ain't no slouch. So, you know? And I love you. You know what I'm saying? 
And I know you love me back with your highest love because I love you with my highest love. You know what I'm saying? Basically, you can tell when a motherfucker trying to take you on a ride called a guilt trip. You know what I'm saying? You can tell when somebody trying to put the okie doke on you. You can tell when somebody desires you. You can look right in their eyes. That's why people always look away and turn their head away. Because they don't ever want you to look in their eyes. The eyes will tell you everything about a person. Without even speaking. I'm going to keep it real. You know what I'm saying? Doing it is not what you think. I see you know that. You know what I'm saying? Your whole family is magical. How about that? And you know you can create anything out here. You one of the best of the best, my baby. You know what I'm saying? I see you learn to save your goodies for somebody who was good to you that actually loved So I see during the day, you know what I'm saying? You, you know, you work for your family business. You know, y'all like contractors. Y'all build stuff. You know what I'm saying? I see you got to arrange marriage. You know, this incest is out here, my baby. Motherfuckers doing sex, sex, sex magicians doing this sex magic. Off these at your you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, they very attracted to you. This cousin of yours. You know what I'm saying? Definitely trying to come mingle with you. They thriving on it. You know what I'm saying? You know, watch this cousin. You know exactly who I'm talking about. And I see you can call bullshit on it. You peeped it one day. What You peeped that they was using dark magic one day. Definitely. I think you peeped them doing it. You know what I'm saying? Yes, you did. You peeped them. You know what I'm saying? Because they didn't hit on you several times. Yes. Yes, they have. And they even told you that they will always sleep with you. This person is happy. Like, you're happy. You're gay. Because you're, you know, you're happy in yourself. That's why you're gay. This person is desire same-sex relationship with the same sex agenda. And they, they didn't told you already that you was going to sleep with them. But you popular and happy, that's why this shit is popping now. I just want you to know that. It's going to always be freaks and demons. You're gonna, all throughout your day, you're going to run across freaks and demons. But just know, it's your time to be popular right now, my baby. Fuck the, the other person, the other woman. You an enigma out here. And you sexy as hell. And that's the tea that we spill on the day. You know what I'm saying? This is not incest. This way is too much for me. You know what I'm saying? I say this person sending you, somebody sending you messages talking about it's hard. It's hard or it's wet. I keep hearing that. And then you got some people trying to swap, couple swap, and this shit is crazy. I just keep hearing in and out. There's a lot of people that's jealous in your family around you. I know you have that. You know that. You know what I'm saying? But right now you're very sensual. You know what I'm saying? I see you're very soft and gentle soul. You know what I'm saying? You're fucking empress. You exude empress qualities. You know what I'm saying? I see you done went out and bought perfume and lingerie today. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be ready to go. You know what I'm saying? For later on. Yeah. And I'm told to tell you to go, dip, go deeper. Dig deeper. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, fuck these petty motherfuckers. I'm giving you hints, my baby. One night stands. You have the right support. You know, just fucking. That's different. This September for National Recovery. Different from making love. A lot of people sold they soul for fame, but the T is you worked your way up. You know what I'm saying? You worked your way up. You didn't have to fuck for a book. You was a star all along. You just found remembered that you was a star. You know what I'm saying? And just know it's obvious. That, you know what I'm saying You got a different fa father Your father is not the same As everybody else's father Now that's out You know what I'm saying You out here getting them baby You the motherfucker star What more can I say my baby I love you I just want you to know To continue to keep watching these patterns Continue to stay out the way Continue to not let motherfuckers suck on you Watch these freaks and demons You know what I'm saying I love you You know what I'm saying and, you know, be careful of distractions and things that, um, 
keeping you from focusing on yourself. And remember, you enjoy your relationship that you have with your higher self. And it's been revealed about this relative. And you're getting revelations now. I'm told you're getting them now. You've been getting them. Pay attention. Remember, things are unfolding for you. And continue to make love outside, my baby. Spend time outside. That's why you're content. But I see you thriving on it. See, you didn't, you didn't know all this shit that was going on at first. You know what I'm saying? But out of nowhere, you start typing in. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, my baby. Well, I love you. You know what I'm saying? Thanks for coming to make love. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's what we do. I see, you know, my original baby. You know what I'm saying? I love you with my highest love. I hope you continue to have a good evening and a, a good next few days. You know what I'm saying? I love you. You need me to call. If I haven't returned your email, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm getting these readings out. You know, today at 1159 is the last day of the sale. But long as you um, book your appointment before then, you're fine. ASAP, I'm I'm, I'm going to get at you, my baby. Love and light. See you in a few ticks, my baby.